Mm -hmm. We start with the ARV. Yep. Minus our profit. So we go we go 70% and then 70% of ARV minus rehab. And that's what we do. So I would suggest you get people that buy in Detroit, find out what they're looking for and what they how much they want to pay for it. Yep. Yeah. You know, and then how much they cost to rehab a unit. Yeah, a lot of people for multifamily, what I've heard from some buyers is usually 45K a door with that's all expenses included. To do better in their business, but I also have to. I don't know how to do it. Um, with that, you know, with that being said, and we're coming close to the end, I don't want to, um, I want to be respectful of your time as well, because we could sit here and talk about real estate all day long and, you know, yeah. we might bring you back on and, you know, what, we might, you know what, I might fly down to Florida just to interview you in person, you know, so oh, I, I happen to have a boat on the Gulf of Mexico. If you want to do it on the boat, <laughs> that would be, that. I would suggest you know Old months of Michigan. I, I, I think we could do that. So, okay. um, 100%, but you know, where are you, what's your plans for the future? You said that you are building brand new, um, brand new multifamilies and where is that going to be? And, uh, you know, how and can you should ask, we should ask why? What's okay. Yeah. Why, why are you why? doing brand new builds, where is it going to be and how can the people here help you in any of your future endeavors? Well, I want to add value to God's been so good to me that I, I just want to help other people and teach, um, helping me, uh, there's, there's people that, so in the syndication on a multifamily, the only thing I need nowadays is people to invest in the properties. So okay. if people want to make passive income. Uh, great passive income and get, you know, if you're a real estate investor, you can get depreciation off the property too. And if you have a $30 million deal, there's a lot of depreciation on a $30 million deal. Yes. Um, depending on how much money you bring to the, to the table, um, you might never have to pay taxes again. I have a friend of mine that is, is $40 million in, uh, uh, in the rears on taxes. So he can make the next $40 million he's going to make. He's not going to be able to, he's not going to be able to pay tax on that. Okay. So all, all the, if people want to invest, uh, I started a, a fund, uh, uh, ARC Investments uh, Ventures, and um, we're going to be building multifamily through the United States. Why do I want to pick North Carolina? We have that property in North Carolina. Mm -hmm. It's a 16 unit we got for a great deal. Our taxes are six thousand dollars. Wow. Our operating expense, our operating expense, are batting around thirty-eight percent. I'm actually surprised that your taxes in North Carolina are only six thousand dollars. To be honest, mm -hmm. so um, that's crazy because I actually used to live in. I lived in Raleigh um, for a little bit, and I have family that lives in Charlotte. I lived in Charlotte a little bit as well. Um, you picked the two highest, you paid the two highest taxes in that, in that state. Yeah. So that's why I was kind of surprised. <laughs> you know? Yeah. You picked, you picked the two highest place. The highest is Charlotte. The next is Raleigh and Raleigh's catching up. Too. Um, where you, where you place something is more, maybe more important than what you put in there. Okay. So okay. we're, we're batting at 38%. Um, what we own or 38% uh, of what we make, we pay out to the property. So that's our expenses. In Michigan, um, that 11 unit, we're paying 12,000 a year in taxes. And the insurance and water and gas is, well, we have gas in Michigan that we have to pay for the property because it's a boiler system. In North Carolina, there's just an electric bill that the tenants pay. Yeah. So yeah. all the way around, it's just cheaper 
to have a, a, a southern state. Um, well, depending on the state, I can't say that. Yeah. Depending on where yeah. you put the property. But um, so, yeah, the my brother, bathroom, my brother sorry. actually says, start coming to Tampa, I'll work with you. Is he but in Tampa? Brother, he lives in Sun City, which is just outside of Tampa. So nice. What did he do? Yeah. So he. Uh, he so right now he uh, he just works at a a job just to make some income. That's it. Um, he works at a, a Texas Roadhouse, but he's looking for a different avenue at the moment. So hopefully, it's real estate. Have him get in touch with me. Yeah, I most definitely. So. And then uh, uh, he said he was in construction. So, uh, and then he, he used to do demos, honestly. It's like, he used to do a lot of clean outs, things like that. And my sister said, I'm in, invite your sister as far as going to, going, going on the boat. That's what she was talking about that. <laughs> <laughs> Tell her to stop on by, man. It's gonna it's gonna be horrible. The weather's always hot. I jumped here. You're gonna love this being from Michigan. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I a friend of mine came in. I let him use my house because I came to Michigan for like August, July and August. And then uh, I had to fly back in. We were doing a flip, and I had to check on a guy. And I, I hung out with my friend. I took him on my boat, and I jumped into the water, and I jumped out going ah. And he goes what? I go the water's too hot. Yeah. So there's there's that there's some problems out here too. So water's too warm. Water's too warm. Yeah, in August. So don't come out in August. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of hot then. So yeah. So. You know. But uh, yeah, it's it's crazy. I want to do more markets right now. I'm just in Metro Detroit. Um, what and that's Detroit proper. That is. All, all three counties that we have. I'm also, I'm starting to dabble in a little bit of Genesee County um, and and also some Washtenaw County as well. So, um, you know, so I deal with all those markets, but I also want to start getting into some, some other markets virtually as well. So- um, Well, if you want to get into North Carolina, you know somebody that wants to be in that area. North Carolina, I, I actually do because I want to get in like the Charlotte area because I have family that still live there. So, um, on the ground. yeah, exactly. So, uh, here's my brother here. Uh, he's a glazer. He used to be a glazer when he was up here in Michigan. So, uh, nice. Windows. He, he did commercial work for windows. So, um, nice. Very nice. Yeah. But, uh, so, you know, how is it, I'd love to actually, you know, get your opinion on some Detroit multifamily, okay, that like, I, I get a lot of Detroit multifamily that need full rehabs, full guts, okay? okay, and I'd be interested to see where you or maybe some of your buyers would be at on a property like that you know that's a, that's a that's a great that's a great idea so you know when we start when we start to do a flip mm -hmm. we start with the ARV. yep minus our profit so we go we go seven percent and then 70 percent of arv minus rehab and that's what we do so i would suggest you get people that buy in detroit find out what they're looking for and what they, how much they want to pay for it. Yep. Yeah. You know, and then how much their cost to rehab a unit. Yeah. A lot of people for multifamily, what I've heard from some buyers is usually 45 K a door with that's all expenses included all expenses as well as, you know, renovations, everything. So, so ARV 45 a door. Yep. Okay. That's that's a good number to start from, and that's a rough estimate because different areas could be a little bit different. So, but um, you know, the more war zone areas, they may not even want that, or it has to be a lot less. You know, um, that's why that's why I'm trying to coach you into finding people that you know where do they buy, what do they want. So I have yep. a friend of mine, Johnny. 
I call him Johnny Versace, and if he hears this, I'm gonna I'm actually gonna send it to him now. Uh, Johnny Versace. His name's not Johnny Versace, but I've been calling that for 30 years, so <laughs> he always goes that. He goes that damn Menino. Um, he he uh, he buys uh, apartment complex. I think he has 300 in Detroit. Okay. So just you know, it, my coaching to you is take him out to lunch. Yeah. Go see his property yeah. and say, what are you looking for, and how can I help? I would love an that guy. That'd be great. Um, and then. I would love to, you know, we'd love to, I'd love to continue these conversations with you. Also, another thing I'd love to do is actually invite you on with my coaching, with my coaching group. Um, and then we can kind of go over um, some things with my coaching group. So we can set that up off, off camera as well. But, uh, you know, I, I'd be interested in that if you, if you're interested. Uh, and kind of I'm, I'm here to I'm here to help in any way, shape, or form. If I can add value to you or your team, please let me know how. That's awesome. So with that, I really do appreciate everyone coming out. I want to be respectful of your time. Uh, we did go over about four minutes for this. I uh, you know, and I I'd love to uh, you know. We're gonna speak without. We're gonna have another introduction. We're gonna have another interview with you, possibly. Um, in person, maybe on the boat, you know, in Tampa. So, and you're not, not going to twist my arm on that one. All right, all right, I'll do it. <laughs> so we'll get that one. You know, we'll we'll need to make some. Uh, uh, you know, we'll need to make get a camera guy out there and do all of that. You know, so maybe I'll I'll tag along some of my family to do that. <laughs> you know, but I uh, love to see you all out there and. I really look, I look forward to speaking more and going from there. From what I hear, the Michigan Washington game right now, we're Michigan is up, go blue. So, nice. Yes. Oh, I, 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 I want everybody to thank me. Okay. I want thank everybody you. in the Michigan to thank me because I finally learned after 57 years, and how to get the Lions to win. I had to leave. Are you to move away? <laughs> <laughs> That's the only way they've won in the last 57 years. And I, I know, right? I'm, I'm rooting for them from Tampa. I swear. Oh, I am too. I don't I do not do fantasy football. That's my brother. He does that. I don't do any of that. But the only thing that I do is – the only thing that I do is just keep up on the Lions. So – yeah, my brother he moved away as well, so he did the same thing. <laughs> you well, know? How long did he move? Maybe me and him moving, you know, made the Lions win. <laughs> exactly. So, but uh, you know, I look forward to our next conversation. I look forward to helping everyone else out here. If you do want a JV on any deals, and if you do have any deals, my number is right here at the bottom. Contact me, email me. Um, we'll go from there. Let's all do deals together. Mike, just hold on for a minute. We'll stick. We'll have you stick around and, until we go. All right? Thanks very much, and I appreciate you guys. Thank you. Have a great day. Let's all do deals together. Once a day that I would pray for you I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too Sneaking looks up and down from across the room Damn, what a hell of a view